In order to teach patients come to sit, we have a variety of ways to do it. Now for healthy people, come to sit is accomplished using the abdominal muscles. So we simply contract the abdominals and come to sit position. For our patients who lack the abdominal muscles, we could either do come to sit from supine or from prone. And um, when training the patient come to set, we need to keep in mind that, okay, this is the final goal, this is the ultimate goal we need to reach, but we might break down, or we most often break down the activity into uh, several components, and we practice each component with the patient separately. And this training might take a long time, might take a considerable amount of the session, uh, like uh, for patients with spinal cord injury, really a considerable as part of the training uh, will be spent on the mattress. So, um, so that's one thing. Now we will learn how to do come to set from uh, supine and from prone. Um, we could uh, modify the technique, as we said, depending on the patient's level. And um, we need to keep in mind one important point, which is to avoid friction when doing these techniques. Uh, as we will see now, for example, when we are walking on the elbow, because we don't want friction with the surface, as this might cause skin breakdown. So we always teach the patient to move their limb and not drag it or um, uh, slide it against the surface.